Hello everyone and welcome to the exercise 6 of the MCAD laboratory. So this is the exercise 6. Here uh, you need to create the front, top and side view for the given 3D model. So as usual you need to create this uh, solid part in the solid modeling. Then you have to go for a drawing view. Then you have to call this 3D model for projecting the principal view. So you can build this model in various approach. So one of the simplest approach I can suggest is first you need to uh, draw this closer sketch in the top reference plane then you have to extrude it for a length of 20 mm after that you have to create a plane uh, at a distance of 30 mm from this surface so here so then you have to draw the closer sketch of this here after that uh, you have to extrude it for a length of 20 mm so let me discuss this in uh, solid uh, edge Go to the solid edge, go to the solid part, click on uh, protrusion, select the top reference plane, then you have to draw this uh, sketch here. So this length is 50, you can see here, that means uh, this length is, uh, this slot is 20, that means 15 mm here, 15 mm here. So fifteen. And inside it is 10 mm. And in 20. you have straight one uh, straight line after that you have a 5 mm cut out here so first i will draw a length of 80 now 80 so this length is 80 now after that 5 mm slot here 5 mm after that 20 mm length so this is 20 here now you have 45 mm length Here we got a reduced 5 mm here, that means this length should be 45. So 45 then. It's the bottom portion of this solid part you can see here then you have to create a plane here so this plane distance should be 30 mm from this uh, reference uh, this surface so I'll go for parallel plane so select this surface so I need a plane at a distance of 30 mm from this reference so I'll enter 30 mm here So the plane is created now so then you have to draw this uh, profile here this sketch so height of this is 25 mm from this surface so it is throughout the length so that means 50 mm length this length is 50 mm so mm and after that we have a height of for 25 mm so draw a line here at a height of 25 mm this height should be 25 now make this distance Yeah. 
now you need to bring this to the center so this is the center of the line the center of this 50 mm line that is you can see here 25 mm this distance is 25 this is exactly in the center of this line so you can see here this is exactly in the center that means from the center it is 5 mm here 5 mm here so you make this and this distance as 5 mm need of this line Click on finish. So that completes this model. Go to named views, click on ISO. Save the file, file save. Save it as model 6. wizard select the file uh, model you have saved this is model 6 click on open click next click on front click next click on finish so I'll make it the scale uh, 1 is to 1 then you click on uh, principal view Select this front view, drag on to the downward direction to get the top view. Similarly, select this, drag towards right to get this side view. Now you go to the again, you go to the drawing view wizard, click OK, click next. Now you click on ISO, click finish. This is your asymmetric model. Can scale to the any dimension required 1 is to 1 2 is to 1 or any scale uh, whichever is uh, comfortable with your uh, sheet you can select so then you go for dimensioning Show the important dimensions. Here also you can show the dimensions. So you can write the text any anything you want like this change the font style font size
write anything you want so this finishes uh,